Hey guys, Simcolor here. Today we're going to do something a bit different. We are not going to take a look at specific things. We are going to create a project from start to, to finish. And this video will serve as an introduction and we'll go over all the things that we are going to do and all the, um, the products and the, um, the tools that we need to actually accomplish that. And what we are going to try to do is actually to build an Uber app. We won't do everything, but we'll try to learn how to do the most interesting part of the app, which is actually to get requests for um, pickups, show the map, show our con current location updated, but we are going to go through that all in a bit. For now, we are going to talk about the tools that we are going to use. We're going to use the Android Studio, because we are building an app for Android, and this is, in my opinion, the best platform to do that in, and Firebase. With Firebase, we are going to do the authentication, because we are going to need a login and registration system, and the database. And Firebase makes it, makes it all really simple for us to do. I already have a tutorial on Firebase where I'm going to continually post videos, so you can check them out anytime you feel uh, any difficulty, any greater difficulty in any of the topics that we are going to talk about. So, the main goal and the objectives that we are going to set up for this series is to, first of all, get a login and registration, both for riders and um, customers, then a map. We are going to use the Google Maps API, and I'm going to explain it a bit. It isn't really hard because the documentation is crisp, it's really good. And in that map, we are going to show our current location, which is going to be systematically updating. So we are not just going to grab it and say that's it. No, we are going to continuously grab it. And every time it changes, we must know that it changed and do whatever we want with it. And with that value, we are actually, we are actually going to save it to the database. And then after all that is done, we are going to get to the main parts of the series, which is to request a pickup for the customer and to give the, the driver, the Uber driver, the opportunity to either accept the pickup or decline it. If he accepts, then we are going to show the distance of the rider to the customer and um, show the updated um, location of the driver to the customer and vice versa. So um, this uh, series will be, I, I believe, about 10 to 12 episodes long, but I'll try to make it as simple as direct to the subject as possible. So let's get on with it. Stay tuned for more. Yeah. Ciao.